What's up, everybody? We're here with another Arcadian preview. This time I've got Alsoda, another PR panelist representing the San Francisco sub region. Hello. How are you doing? I am very tired right now. You're very tired. Very yeah. tired. It, it, it's only going to get more tiring. We've only got Ugh. about nine days left before the Arcadian at That's the time crazy. of this recording. Nine uh, days. Recording. <laughs> it is, yeah, it, it, it's, it, it's Arcadian season. The tournaments are in full swing. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I wanted to talk to you about, first of all, how you feel about the Arcadian, and then I wanted to get your list of names to watch out for. They could be dark horses. They could be people that you want to highlight. Mm -hmm. uh, but, yeah, and I know that since you're from SF, mm -hmm. and this is, a, this is a tournament that brings people from all the sub-regions mm -hmm. together, uh, you definitely have perspective on some names that some of us might be sleeping on for one reason or another. All right, right. Yeah, so um, let's get into it. So my number one top pick is Wanyan. Yeah, uh, Met yeah. Menai player. Uh, I know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, it's just like I play him like all the time at our uh, SFSU weeklies, and it's just like the amount of like training and the amount of like hard work he puts in to like you know get yep. better at with the characters like ridiculous. Like there'd be sometimes I'd be tuning into a stream and he's just like labbing hella stuff like frame perfect combos or like just theory crafting like other Meta Knight stuff, and I'm just like, damn, okay, he's yeah. got it. And then like he actually implements them, and I'm just all like. How is this guy not ranked? Like, I, yeah, that's that's yeah. what I'm saying. When I when I watch him play, it feels like I'm watching like an actual like yeah. pop Meta Knight. And the thing about it too is like we don't have that many we don't have that many Meta Knights here in NorCal. Yeah, we have a couple, but their their activity is pretty sparse. Yeah. So I'd say that they are they are good players, but yeah. yeah, we don't see them very often. No, yeah, definitely. Um, so yeah, one is my number one pick. Uh, number two, yep, uh, that's good number one actually. Uh, number two would be Anna. And a Pikachu player, Pikachu, uh, Box Pikachu. By Box, the way. Pikachu. Box Pikachu. That is a world of difference, by the way. Box Pikachu. I can I can talk a little bit about Enna as well. I've played Enna a few times, like not only in our private brackets, but here at Guildhouse. Mm -hmm. Enna is just a super technical player, very yeah. very smart player. You, yeah. Have you ever talked with Enna? They have a lot of knowledge about not just Pikachu specific things, mm -hmm. but just the game itself. A lot of theory crafting. Yeah. Not only that, but like uh, every like again going back to the SFSU weeklies. Um, yeah. You know they would just be like playing the game and like they were, like they recently hit me up and tell me like yo like I'm not trying to play a, a defensive or an aggressive type of Pikachu. I'm trying to play like in the thin line between those two and try to develop my own play style. Yeah. And I'm just all like oh you know you don't see that many Pikas like do that at all. Like you don't see, see many Pikas in general. Yeah. You, yeah. You don't see that many yeah. Pikas in general. Uh, but like regardless like if you even see a peak it's either like a defensive or an aggressive one so yeah. it's just like it's really hard to play like in the thin line of both of those and like Anna is just like always hitting me up saying like oh how do I like improve in the situation or like option select or like yeah. what or like what are some things I should be doing and I'm just like you know I, I just sit down and be like all right give me VODs what do you have I'll look over them like you should be doing this work on this or like you know instead of like doing this like aggressive or hard call out just like you know try to like play more smart and think about like what's going to benefit benefit you in the long run yeah and that 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 goes a long way i could definitely see uh enna being you know a ranked player someday yeah i know you definitely yeah they're relatively young too they are they are yeah. they they just finished their first year of college yeah so, so like a lot of a lot of young people i mm -hmm. guess i can say that but <laughs> yeah not everyone yeah. can anyway yeah ne so uh enna and i i can guess the next name you're about to say like, can you guess? Can I? I can guess one of the next two names you're about to say. Okay, guess. Yeah, my what, my next. If I was you, I would say Ito. Uh, well, he's not SF, but yeah, like he okay, he, yeah. Do, he does. Funny enough, he actually comes out to a lot of SF stuff like during the school year, surprisingly. So it's yeah. just like, I guess I could consider him SF. Yeah. So it's just like yeah. Um, he's been like alternating through a lot of characters. But, like, for a good while now, he kind of, like, settled a little bit more on the Sora, which I'm, yeah. like, kind of happy for, for him because um, I kind of be telling him, like, yo, just play who you have fun with. Don't, like, think meta. Just, like, play the character you enjoy playing. And then, That's like, fair. I mean, like, just in my opinion, like, Sora can be a little bit boring or lame to play against. Yeah. But it's just, like, you know, the character fit him. And it's, like, there's nothing I can blame. Like, you know, if you really want to play Sora, I respect it. And then, like, every time you play playing, like, you know, if he actually... You actually do be doing some cool stuff. I'm just like, you know, I can't argue. You're actually doing. You're you're making this character hype. Yeah. All right. All right. What are the what are the last two names for you? So, yeah, I guess I could throw Ito in there. Yeah. Um. So I guess the other two. Uh, Johnny Law. Johnny Law. Can't forget about Johnny Law. Ball, AKA Bong Water. Bong Water. <laughs> hey, that that's his name on Star GG. You know. I don't know if he's gonna be able to change it. You know, I feel. 
I still feel so bad about Last Arcadian, the fact that I had to play him, because like, uh, yeah, I got I got so early, and then I didn't like know that he'd be in my pad, so that that kind of just like ah, uh, that that kind of like killed not killed my motivation, but like made me like really like, damn, I didn't really want to do this, but like. Uh, he like recently started coming back a little bit more because you know Arcadian he wants to try to do good yeah and then like obviously I'm like playing games with him I'm telling him like what to do or like you know advice on how to work the matchups or like especially the character itself so it's just like you know for someone who hasn't like played in a long time and like when I get to play him I can I can kind of see like you know he hasn't lost his touch of style like he still has his character yeah he still has his combo routes so like you know it's still there so you know there's still time within these nine days for Johnny to improve and like you know just skyrocket where he is right now yeah and then for my last one you know i was kind of like tossing between these two people but if i had to pick pick leper oh uh aka formerly steamy noodles, steamy noodles yeah yep no yeah i've played them before yeah. that's a that's a belmont player Mm-hmm. Very underrated. Surpri- another one of those surprise they've never yeah. been ranked players. Like if if you saw Leper uh post pandemic when uh local started coming back, like he was yeah. literally tearing through. I I think he actually like got top twenty in the literally like the, the bracket? Yeah, but like that was like the post. It, it didn't even like come for PR or anything like that. It was more oh, like yeah. leading up. But like I think yeah. he I think he actually like got top twenty and at that time, so it's just like kind of ridiculous. Yeah. So it's just like for Belmont, especially in our region where like we have really hard characters to play with. Yeah. It's just like really surprising and really good to see how he like climbed that huge level of like, you know, player skill and just like trying to get to those get to get to that level. Yeah. So it's just and then like he kinda like was gone for like a year or so for Norcal General. Tournaments some, in general. Yeah, in tournaments in general. Yeah. Had some things to do. Like, don't blame him. Like, he's got to do yeah. what he's got to do. Real life. And then, priority. Um, yeah, priorities. Yeah. Came back. And uh, they were at Big Guild House, was their last, was their first tournament back. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, when yeah. the season started? I think so, yeah. Oh, okay. That's good to know. Yeah. But, um, yeah, uh, Leper, he's back. He's been doing really good in SF. Uh, been top eighting consistently, getting some good wins. And then, you know, he's also, like, making a trip out here to Guildhouse. I'm, I'm pretty sure I saw him here earlier today, but, like, yeah. I think he's here. But, yeah. He? Yeah. That's a very, that's a really strong name. Great list, yeah. by the way. Thank you so much for mm-hmm. that. There you have it. Five names to watch out for from SF slash Ito. Hey, honorary SF. Yeah. Honorary yeah. SF. But, uh, yeah, this is going to be a great Arcadian. Thank but, yeah. you so much, Al Soda. Yeah, of course. And we'll Thanks. see, will we see you at the Arcadian? Yes, I will be at the Arcadian. I am doing doubles with Retro. Okay, awesome. And we'll see you at the Arcadian on the 12th, nine days from now. I did not forget that. Nine days from now, we'll see you at the Arcadian, twitch.tv slash guildhouse. If you want to go tune in and watch, it will be live. We'll have doubles, we'll have singles, and we'll see who's ready to become the next avatar of NorCal. Yeah, don't forget to keep on practicing so you can just make upsets. And exactly. then you'll be ranked someday too. Exactly. All right. Thank you so much. Thanks for having me. Yep.